Hey folks, what's up? Chef Jesse here on a Friday evening. It looks like it's going to rain. This weather's crazy. It's thundering. It's like thunderstorms. Anyway, today I'm going to be making um, <clears throat> two types of, well, I'm going to be making some fish um, fish fillets for myself with french fries. And for Gilbert, I'm going to be making salmon. Okay, salmon or salmon, how people say it. I don't know. I don't care. So, uh, I got a piece of salmon or salmon right here. Here we go. Look at that. With the skin, okay. Okay. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to easily uh, season this up. Anytime you touch fish, just wash your hands constantly, constantly, constantly. So here we go. Wash my hands. Okay. So we're going to season this with something very simple. We're going to be using some kosher salt, uh, a teaspoon of kosher salt, a half a teaspoon of black pepper, and a half a teaspoon of paprika. Okay. So I want you to come on in. And watch this. I have this sauce. I'm going to cook it up, and but I don't want you to see that just as yet. Okay, so there we go, my son. Okay, so we got the uh, the salt. Let me mix this up. The salt, the pepper, and the um, paprika. So I pat it dry. I pat it dry the salmon. Okay, I pat it's pat, pat dry already. Okay, and I'm just going to season this with, with this. Okay, so I'm going to put this over here. Okay, and I'm just gonna season that up and then like that. Uh, let me do the skin side a little bit. Okay, it doesn't matter the skin. Okay. So, <clears throat> this, okay, so here I go. Okay, this is a, so, I'm gonna be cooking this in a sauce that I created. Uh, I've used uh, honey. I have honey, I have soy sauce, I have uh, lemon lemon juice in there, and um, I think that's about it, and olive oil. Okay. So this, this uh, piece of salmon here is going to be cooked up in that sauce. But first I'm going to sear it in, the, in, my, in a cast iron skillet. I'm going to sear it for a minute or two on the skin side, and then I'm going to take it out, lay it to the side. Cook, uh, cook up my sauce and then we turn the fish into that sauce cook it up for three minutes and then I'm gonna put it in the broiler for a couple more minutes so the sauce gets nice and thick and hopefully this will work because I think this is the second time I'm trying to do this so anyway folks that's what I'm gonna be doing today so we got some fish fillets myself fish fillets for in the oven out of a box those are out of the box the salmon is not the salmon is fresh salmon the fish uh, I don't eat salmon so Fish is out of the box. Did you get that? And the French fries, of course, obviously out of a bag, right? So I'm gonna be going French fries, French fries, and fish tonight. Fish and you know, fish and you know, fish and chip on it. Fish, it's fish with fries. So um, I'm gonna let the salmon maybe marinate in there, the seasoning I put in there for about five or ten minutes, and then we're gonna start cooking up and get the cast iron skillet, and we are going to start making up our base. Sear the uh, we're gonna sear the skin of the salmon, and then we're gonna take like I said we're gonna take it out, put it to the side, and then uh, create the, the the glaze. It's it's a honey garlic glaze. That's what it is. It's a honey garlic glaze sauce that I'm gonna be making. Yeah. So let me get my cast iron skillet. You guys know my sky, my cast iron skillet. Cast iron skillet. Right? Oh yeah, this is heavy. So yeah. So it's a honey glazed. Honey glazed garlic. That's what. That's what the name is in the, in the recipe. So uh, let me get my oil to make some uh, make some French fries. We are. Be, I'm gonna be using some Needix. Needix French fries, which are nice and thick, big. Yeah. And uh, okay. So this is what I got in this plate here. In this little cup of meat. Okay. The sauce. Okay. So. Okay. So. Uh, I'll be right back. I'm going to a commercial. So, folks, I am warming up my cast iron skillet. Remember, it's got to be nice and hot. In order for you to sear the uh, the skin, you have to get it nice and hot. And this, you know, these cast iron skillets withstand high heat. So, and it takes a little while. So, I put two tablespoons of olive oil in there, and I'm going to I'm warming it up now as we speak and get it nice and hot, nice and hot. Uh, where it 
it's gonna when I drop this fish in there, it's gonna get it's gonna to sear it, it's gonna be hot, it's gonna be a lot of smoke. I gotta close the door because if not, smoke goes to the bedroom and the smoke detector goes off, so I'll be right back. So folks, I am heating up my oil and in a few minutes, in a few seconds maybe, I'm gonna add my three tablespoons of butter, okay? So the butter into the oil. Just making sure that the oil is nice and hot because I want to see it. And I'm gonna turn on my broiler because my broiler is what's gonna help me um, cook this, finish cooking up this uh, salmon. Okay, so, uh, stay with me. So, there goes the smoke. I put the butter in here and the olive oil together, melting this butter, and then we are going to put, throw the, uh, the fillet, the uh, salmon in there to, to, to sear it up. Trusty handle here made out of leather. This is for the handle. Okay. Okay. Get a spoon. I can never find a spoon that I'm looking for a spoon. And when I'm not looking for a spoon, I find a spoon. Isn't that ridiculous? There you go. Okay, so we are going to, I think this is high enough. This looks like it's high enough. We're gonna see it. Okay, we're gonna see it. The skin, skin up, skin down. A couple of minutes just to sear that skin. Okay. Ooh, this is hot. So, folks, there you got it. I am going to remove it now and then I'm going to start cooking it. So, yeah, look at that. Ooh. Okay, so. So, folks, in the here, I am going to. I see it a little bit, and now I'm gonna put it back in. Okay, facing down, and I'm gonna put my sauce in here. Okay. Yeah, garlic. This heats up. You can see that it's starting to thicken up. I'm gonna cook this for like three minutes, and then I'm gonna put in the broiler. Okay. And that's my broiler should be on. Three minutes. Inside down, okay, three minutes, and then I'm gonna have my broiler. I'm gonna put in my broiler for maybe um, another three minutes or so and get that sauce nice and thick and it's uh, and glazed up. And you go just keep putting it over. Yeah. So you got that honey, glazed garlic. Oh man. Looking good. I don't know. How about you? So it's looking good. Yeah. Okay. And in a few minutes, I am about to put it into the broiler and start cooking it in the broiler. So stay tuned. Don't go nowhere. So, folks, I am about to bring out this salmon. Oh my god, it looks good. And I don't eat salmon, but look, look at this. Look at this. Ooh. Look at that. It looks like a steak. Oh, a lot of smoke. I'm gonna let it continue cooking on there. I don't want to overcook it. Let it settle in there. Put some of this garlic honey sauce over it. And we should be taking this to the table in a few minutes. So don't go over there. I want you to stay with me. So folks, my salmon is done. I'm just waiting for my fries. My salmon is done. I made it using, uh, I seared it, and I took it out of the pan, and then I put butter, olive oil, and then I made a sauce with honey and 
garlic and uh, soy sauce and olive oil, all that mixed together. I threw it into the uh, cast iron skillet, I cooked it up, and then I threw it into the broiler for like four minutes. So it's nice and blackened, it looks like a piece of steak actually. But we're gonna go to the table and you, uh, I want you to see how it looks in the inside. So don't go nowhere, in another minute we're going to the table. So folks, I'm at the table, and what we did today was a piece of salmon, or salmon, as some people say, right? Uh, I, I got a recipe, it's a garlic honey glazed salmon, so that's why it looks blackened and, uh, and stuff, but because it's got soy sauce in it, and it's got all kind of greens in it. It looks good, it smells good, I don't know if it tastes, I don't eat salmon, but we'll see, but it looks pretty good. I, I cooked it for like uh, three minutes on a stove top, and then I threw it into the boiler, and you gotta be careful with salmon, because it one minute it's cooked, one minute it's not, so it's like in between. So it's a real fine line too, but it looks good. And uh, that, so there goes the main course of the night. So you can see on the side there, you can see the salmon in. The top is seared, and uh, the sauce is put on it. So yeah, look at that. So those that look good. Uh, the table looks like this. At my end, I have some uh, fish, fish fillets with fries. Very simple. And. Um, yeah, so we're gonna sit down and we are going to try this out. So folks, let's try this out. Yeah, let's try this honey glaze. I let him try it, that's the guest star of the show. Yes, of course. Ah. I haven't had salmon in so long, it's a for it. You put a lot of soy sauce and kind of garlic in it. Lots of flavor. Ginger and garlic, soy sauce. No ginger in it. Want ginger? Huh? It's garlic. Oh, wow. Garlic, some soy sauce, two tablespoons of soy sauce. Okay. It was uh, honey, uh, olive oil, uh, two tablespoons of soy sauce, two tablespoons of water, and uh, that was it. Oh, and some lemon, some lemon juice. So uh, that was what the glaze was made up from, and uh, and then I seasoned the. Salmon with paprika, salt and pepper. That's it. Very simple. I seared it for two couple minutes and then I threw it into the. Uh, oh, I've been watching. Okay, you see what I do. Anyway, folks, that's what's uh, well for today. Um, and uh, end of the week. Weekend. Pride Month has begun. Pride Month the first has begun. Pride yeah. event this weekend starts in Queens in New York City. So that's going to be fun for all those people that hang out. So folks, come on and show your support. We've got, we've come a long way, but we got a long way to go. A long way to go. And now these politicians are trying to go backwards. This whole country is, uh, I don't know, I, 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 don't, I don't even want to look at politics anymore because we are heading backwards. It's, it's weird. We are heading backwards. And uh, it's a shame. It's a shame. The, one of the world's, the world's biggest country, powerful and all that good stuff. And everyone wants to come to America. We are heading backwards, and that's a shame. And it's scary. Not only is it a shame, it's scary. So, go on to show your support and um, get involved in organizations that support and all that stuff. But that's all. I know everybody wants to party and all that kind of stuff, but take a minute to support, to actually support uh, organizations that are out there fighting for us. So, keep that in mind, folks. We've got a long way to go. Uh, we're not there yet. And I don't know if we'll ever get there in my lifetime, but. We have to keep the fight so that other future generations, um, our community, could, uh, could walk along the streets and just in freedom, right? So anyway, folks, with that said, happy Gay Pride Month, and uh, you'll probably see us in going to places and stuff like that. I don't know what, what's going on, but uh, happy Pride, what can happy I say? Pride. So, uh, show your colors. So anyway, folks, with that said, we are going to go continue eating, and we will see you tomorrow. No, tomorrow we got some Cuban sandwiches, I think. Yeah. yeah okay. some Cuban, yeah. We got some Cuban sandwiches tomorrow, so you'll see how I do that. You've probably seen it before, but if you haven't, stay tuned. I can see you guys. Have a great night. Be careful if you go out. I'll tell you, the weather's crazy. Have a great night.